making what it is today. All right, failure to hoga, but usse pehle let me see how many log hain jo jante hain about the world of Citadel. Achhi tarike se. So, main aapse puchna chahunga, how many Citadel series have been created so far? Sorry, two. Please tell me which one. Okay. Anybody else? Anybody else? You were right. Other than, but we have three now. We already lost to Jesus. So, but you were right. I'll give it to you, and I'll be party with you. There are three now. So, one is the U.S., one is the Italian, and now the Indian version, which is the honey party. Now, that was the easy one. I'll give you another easier. Uh, what was Priyanka Chopra's name in the first two launch series? Dude, looks like you've done your homework so well. I love you for that. Thank you. And you as well. Thank you. It is Nadia. Now, when does Citadel Honey Bunny launch? Now, this basic homework I just... Of course, my darling. Yes, 7th November it is. You're right. You can be louder, man. Come on. I see you on your content on social media. We're out there and we love you for that. So thank you. Thank you so much. And now, let me ask you out of the syllabus question. While we know Honey Bunny are Ellie Spires, can you guess what Varun and Samantha's cover professions are in this series? Actress and stuntman. Sorry? I said, I'm going to go to the next one. I'm going to confirm the next one. There are a lot of things undercover, so you know, I really don't know, and I don't think so. We'll reconfirm that when we get to see the trailer. They spill the beans, and you know, we get more information on that. So now, folks, it's time to set the mood for the adrenaline filled roller coaster that lies ahead in the form of Citadel Honey Bunny. And trust us, you are in. Or a ride. But before that, before we see the trailer, let's meet the masterminds behind the series. Gives me immense pleasure and join me in welcoming on stage Vice President Asia Pacific and Middle East North Africa Prime Video, Gaurav Gandhi. And I must say, what a fantastic year it has been for Prime Video. And you know, you've always spoken about how content from Asia is on the cusp of a global breakthrough. Now, and we've been seeing that happen with Prime Video. And would also like to highlight that a lot of the, uh, you know, our audience today comprises media from Southeast Asia and UAE as well that have joined us online. And I'm sure, like me, they are also keen to know if Asia's moment has finally come when it comes to breakthrough stories. Thanks, Mir. And thank you, thank you so much. media from India, Cheers. South Asia, uh, UAE. We're all here today and supporting us. Uh, big thank you. And we thank you to all those who tuned in online as well. Uh, actually, yes, to answer your question, we are actually seeing Asian content break new grounds globally. And while this is not new, what's happening is it's happening much more often and regularly. And, and it's, it's generally across the board. Uh, the interesting part of me is that they are all authentic stories uh, and presented in a unique flavor that audiences around the world have begun to really crave or enjoy. Uh, and each of these are successful in the home country and then of course around the world. Uh, and I think the, the idea really here of, of this is that you make rooted global stories but with universal themes. And that's what really people are you know, really enjoying today. Well, you kind of absolutely got it. What was also interesting is that, you know, you had one blockbuster success after another. And in India, be it Panchayat, be it Mirzapur, and the recently a Colin Bay, which is also one of my favorites. And not just in India, these shows have uh, cultivated a new fan base uh, for Indian content the world over. So, but I want to understand from you, how has the year been so far for Prime Video? Oh, thank you. The year's been great. Uh, of course, the shows we talked about, my favorites as well, Panchayat, Mirzapur, Kalmi Pay, were all big hits. But we also had amazing hits like Pocho. We had two big unsuited shows, Paulo Karbayar and Riyan Men, that really were appreciated across India and around the world. Uh, and not just in India, but across the AFAC region, we've actually had a family. Uh, Silent Service in Japan was amazing, successful. 
uh, our globally successful fran uh, franchise, uh, LOL. Hello and namaste. A very warm welcome to esteemed members of the press representing India, Southeast Asia, and the Middle East, and everyone present here today. We're so excited that we're about to unveil the trailer for Citadel Honey Bunny, the latest series to launch within the world of Citadel. When we originally sat down with Chen Salki at Amazon and began weaving together the idea that would eventually become Citadel, it was always our vision to create a narrative that not only would entertain the audience, but also would connect people from every corner of the globe in a shared experience. Within Citadel are connected stories crafted by the best creative teams from around the world. With Raj and DK and Sita and the entire team behind Citadel Honey Bunny, we absolutely have the best of the best on board to deliver a thrilling, action-packed story that feeds into a larger world. We want to thank Raj, DK, Sita, Varun, Samantha, and the incredibly talented ensemble cast for bringing this chapter born from the world of Citadel to audiences across the globe. And we wish to thank all of you for being here today. We're confident you will enjoy the trailer and we hope you will love the show when it launches November 7th. Well, Let's do this. Absolutely. Let's go. Woo! Action. Super loved it, didn't you? You did, right? Ah, ah. In the past, I've used uh, words like amazing, insane, awesome, blockbuster, dhamakedar, and many such words, but all these words seem inadequate for what we've just witnessed right here on screen. Marathi Bodhunavan, full danga trailer. And we're looking forward to it, but uh, I know the two people have a lot more to say of this. I think it's time for us to finally have them on stage. Ladies and gentlemen, and everyone in the house, let's welcome Honey Bunny! Honey. Honey and Bunny, a bit of a swagger there. Give him a round of applause. These are my guys. Done? Light doesn't fly good. A little more lights and then another round of pictures. I promise. Alright. Uh, first things first, congratulations. The trailer looks Power back teaser the literally teased kiya tha. Trailer to literally, uh, you know, we and Samantha was right here and we were just done. I'm like, dude, so much action, so much power, so much drama. We're looking forward to it. And, you know, I have to say, Honey Bunny has this lovely ring every time. Even last time I said this, it has a lovely ring. Let's sit there, Honey Bunny. And, uh, you know, so we just saw the trailer and both of your absolute badasses. And I mean, uh, how? Did you guys undergo any special training for this series? I mean, a lot of things happen. I think actors, in most uh, things that they do, they go, they do undergo some training. And we did. We were under the chakra chaya of uh, Raj and DK and Sita. And uh, honestly, for me, I was just following what Raj and DK were telling me to do. I've completely surrendered in this uh, very unlike the other processes of me doing films. Uh, so it's. I hope that the audience likes it. I hope you guys like it. So this is very rewarding. Uh, to see this now over here and then everyone else watching it on YouTube or any other social media. But uh, what I can remember is my initial conversations with uh, Gaurav about this uh, show and how we are going to make it and uh, it's been such a long road but thank you for making it happen. We've, uh, and so thank you Amazon for making this happen. Thank you so much. Like Parang said, I think it's good people to surrender to Raj and DK, their vision and their storytelling is, I think every actor's dream to be part of their uh, world. 
because it's definitely a unique world, world and it, it shows, I think it shows. Um, it's incredible, it's been a long journey and we're very excited that we're finally here, I'm very close to the release of our series, our baby. We put in a lot of work into this, so uh, I'm really glad that all of you love the trailer and the teaser as well, looking forward. Wishing you both the best for Citadel Honey Money and Varun, congratulations, you've completed 12 years uh, in the industry on the 12th of October. A few days back, you gave us 16 fantastic movies. Let's have a huge round of applause and congratulations. Thank you, Varun. Now, what convinced you to choose Citadel Honey Bunny as your first series and how is uh, how different is the role of Bunny uh, from the other action heroes that you portrayed so far? Honestly, it's because of uh, Family Man. When I saw Family Man 1 and 2, I saw Sam was in it as well. And I saw that show and it was a late night phone call with uh, DK. He must have wondered why I'm calling him so late. And uh, we just started discussing uh, just action and how I've never done action. And uh, what's the space of action I want to do. And I don't think he was supposed to tell me at that point. But uh, he leaked it. He told me that they're doing something with the Russos. And uh, I was like, you had me at Russos. <laughs> I was like, what is what is this? Like Russo's and Raj and DK. I was not, I was just like, my God, this is something global. This is going to be huge. And uh, then I met Raj, and then uh, Raj was like, you know, this this can happen, that can happen. We can do this with the character. And I was just like, the possibilities are endless. And in my heart, honestly, I was manifesting and hoping that Samantha will uh, be the you know actor they'll want with me in this. And uh, I, I think I said it to you all before you all told me about her. Did, did, I, I said, I said, this can be Samantha, right? Because I, I'd just seen Thank Family Man 2 when I was a fan and I was like, no, I was a fan when I saw Maki, honestly. <laughs> uh, so, and Thank you. so I think everything just came together. There's KK Sir in this, who I'm a huge fan of. There's Sikandar, who I'm so happy that we are sharing screen space for the first time. I've known him since, he bullied me when I was a child, so. This is great. Uh, the Sakib, who I'm very fond of, he's a dear friend. And so many other friends that I've made who are here, who I'm going to introduce you to very soon. Uh, so it's just a really, really special universe I think we've created. Your manifestations work well for you. Now, Samantha, my question for you. Now, stepping into the shoes of a fierce female spy is no small feat. Now, what were your first thoughts when you were approached for the role of Honey? And what made you decide, yes, I'm going to do this? I mean, from time immemorial, we're just used to, if there is a spy series or a film, it's always a male character at the center of it, <laughs> doing all the cool action and saying all the cool dialogues and uh, also saving the day, mostly. <laughs> so I think that what sets this apart is the fact that I get to kick some ass as well. <laughs> and it's fantastic, so I think that Finally, you know, with the series Citadel, and to be part of such a internationally connected spy world with connected stories with people like Priyanka Chopra and Matilda and doing some of the heavy lifting ourselves, it's just an amazing way to represent finally women of society correctly, maybe. <laughs> because we do it all, don't we? It's a balanced world of Citadel Honeymoon. Yeah, so it was just it was it was just too tempting and awful, and um, I manifested. In fact, the well. men are outnumbered. <laughs> the women are definitely leading the way in the Citadel universe. Yeah. <laughs> we are looking forward to we that. We are very supportive men. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you for that. Thank you for that. And we did get a glimpse of that in the trailer as well. A super powerful uh, performance there, and we can't wait for the seventh of November. Now, uh, we cannot wait when it launches, as I said, on the 7th of November. And uh, now I'm going to request uh, Nikhil, Raj, DK, Sita to please join us back on stage uh, as we deep, you know, deep dive into more conversations, trying to get more details as to what we can. The way Varun, you know, managed to get some, you leak some information. I'll try my best to get some questions and get some info out so that I know we, what we can look forward to, some masala. And uh, First of all, congratulations to all of you. Fantastic trailer, we loved it. And if you could step a little forward, thank you. A little forward, yeah. Thank <laughs> you. 
Well, unfortunately, KK Menon Sir, Sakib and uh, Simran Man couldn't be here for prior commitments. Uh, but a big shout out to them as well. And first of all, congratulations to all of you. And power back trailer, as you know, uh, Nikhil also says, uh, action back Kamaka that we look forward to. Uh, now, to all of you, the cast, I would like to ask you Citadel Honey Money is the Indian series from the world of Citadel and a pivotal part of the larger world of Spice. Now, how was the experience of being part of this mega project? To the cast, Kashmi, starting with you, the little hi, how are you? You're looking beautiful. Thank you so much for your part. Um, I want some actually, I mean, I know, this is my first show. Um, this is my first step to achieving my big dream of becoming an actor. So I'm really glad that I got to be a part of this mega project and I got to work under the amazing director oh, Rajani Kitsar and also see them I'm also so so really fun and with you. Um, I'm really happy actually. I love this person. Thank you know, you're lucky to have them, but I'd say they're not the same as they're also lucky to have you because they're so great. Thank you so much for having me. What about you guys? Uh, so, yeah. So, so, as a kid, you always dream of, uh, you know, hitting girls, riding bikes, shooting guns. So, it's an imagination as a child. But Raj and Dikas have made it true for me at the age of 35. So, I'm here. <laughs> Well, I actually was a spy uh, in my previous life and while Raj and DK sir were researching on Family Man, that's when they met me and they took all the info from me as to how to make a show on spies and everything. So that's when I said that let me come to your time and be a part of your show and your universe. And yeah, I lent a hand to them. I think... Uh, is this story at all believable, what I'm saying right now? Yeah, thanks for so that's why they took me. I think I'm a good actor. <laughs> 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 yeah, I just wanted to bully him one of them. Yeah. It's been a while since I bullied him. So give me a chance to bully him again. He bullied everyone. They were really nice to... In fact, I didn't hate Shock. So he's again in the previous life of his own. <laughs> uh, but yeah, so I was like, Raj, DK, please take me in this. I didn't bully Varun again. But in fact... Uh, yeah, it was great to share screen space with them. It was good fun to work with Samantha, uh, Baron, Raj, DK, Sita, Ram. You know, it was it was beautiful. Yeah, to be a part of this show. Uh, and as you've seen the trailer, I think it speaks for itself. It's fantastic. Super. Congratulations. Wishing you the best. Thank you so much. Thank you. Shh, that'd be great so that when they are answering, we don't get uh, disturbed. Rather, my questions to both of you. Now, can you share some behind the scenes insight like, to the development uh, process and tell us about the discussions with uh, Russo Brothers and Prime Video on how to weave the story of Citadel Honey Money uh, into the world of Citadel? Long, long ago, before COVID came, uh, we met uh, Jennifer Salke, uh, who had an idea to make uh, uh, this interconnected universe. And uh, so, yeah, we had to say yes. <laughs> and then uh, we met uh, the Russo. They flew into LA to meet the uh, Russo brothers and the team. And uh, we came over. So, I, you know, we, our series, it starts way before uh, the first Citadel years. Because since the timelines, we are based in the 90s. So, this is almost the way everything began, you know, and how the future installments will play out. So it was starting afresh almost, we didn't have any reference to look up to because obviously we are in the 90s so we don't get all the crazy gadgets that are available today. But we had to rely a lot on the things that people did in the 90s. 90s also happens to be my favourite period of probably filmmaking and life because I was at that age where I was uh, running wild probably at that age. <laughs> but uh, yeah, so it was really, really fun. Uh, so Bunny... Bunny is an orphan. Yeah, I think you can answer it. I don't know what I can say or no. Yeah, he's an orphan. And uh, KK sir, who plays Baba, obviously you can understand the relationship over there. is like a mentor figure for me. And that's how everything unfolds. And uh, 
you know, and then obviously me and Sam, there's a big Hindi film industry backdrop to our entire series. And like I said, I love the 90s because my father made so many films in the 90s. So I would always come up with suggestions and tell Rajan, why can't you use this song? Why can't you use, you know, a song from Subhaj Gai's film? So we would always keep debating on the music and references of what my character would probably hear at that time. Or the kind of Mumbai, I, I, I think at that time, Mumbai tone that I would speak in. So I have like two ways I speak. One is the way how Agent Rahi speaks and one is the way how Bunny speaks. Yeah, so, knocked himself out with the impersonation. Yeah. <laughs> And every time I would use any bad words, Sita would get very upset with me and she'd be like, No! You cannot abuse. This is not the tone. I'm not that bad. <laughs> but uh, yeah, I think he was right around the time travel. It is the 90s. We went back to the 90s. So yeah, yeah. So we look forward to that. Thank you. Uh, coming to you, Samantha. Before I ask the question, now I would say this, this is in collaboration with Sita. <laughs> because we tired, yeah, we, we. <laughs> So we had a conversation, and I said we saw it in the trailer. So if you, if I could request you to do that for us, get a surprise, okay, but now. <laughs> so I took permission. I said let me in collaboration with Sita. It's not me alone. So, so yeah, can we do this? <laughs> Thoda. Why, why, why are you show her how it's done, Sita? Not me. I'm not <laughs> Okay, so that's like the words she has to say. Shall we? Acha, to pehle surprise hi dikhao. Abhi dar jao. Abhi do mix karo. Are you bigger? You know they were they were they were just bullying me on set. This wasn't written. It wasn't written at all and they just decided, okay, let's have some fun with her, and it, it actually found its way into the <laughs> series. It wasn't written, and it did hear as well. I get bullied a lot on set. Thank you for being a sport. Thank you. Uh, Samantha, the future is truly uh, female and Citadel has such strong uh, female characters. We've seen that, you know, we uh, have Jonas in the US Citadel, then we also saw uh, Matilda in Citadel, Diana, and uh, of course, your character, which is Honey. Now, uh, little Nadia is also here. Young Nadia, how are you? Enjoying? Of course. Of course. Yeah, I'm enjoying. Thank you for being here. Thank you. And so, Samantha, so what do you think about the female star power that has uh, the world of Citadel is bringing forth? Shall I have all the digital questions? <laughs> okay, um, I know it sounds really cool, like the future is female, but I mean, I'd, I'd like for it to be equal, like an equal playing ground, maybe, like where yeah, yeah, yeah. intelligence, talent, uh, strength decides your fate irrespective of gender. I think that would be an amazing place to be. Uh, at and um, I'm also very happy to be part of this world where <coughs> that has already started to take center stage and also the, uh, just the opportunity to work with talent from across the world. It's already the platform is already just become so much wider, the opportunities, the world, everything seems like the future seems bright mm -hmm. for everyone. And the round of applause just said it all to what you said. So thank you. Thank you so much. And next question is for Kashmir. Before I ask the question, give me a big high five. Yeah. Super confident, Kashmir. Thank you. Kashmi, since you're playing the younger Nadia, a uh, character played so amazingly by Priyanka Chopra Jones in the Citadel. Now, can you tell me what is it like for you and how was the experience uh, with Varun and Samantha as, uh, you know, on-screen Papa and Mommy? Well, first of all, um, I'm really glad that I got to be part of the show. And when I was in DK, like, so when I was in DK, sir, or we got on a call um, after the audition, when they told me that I'm going to be playing Priyanka Chopra, um, as Nadia, I was like, I was really happy. I was thrilled to know that I would be playing her. Because I mean, Franka Chopra, she's an all-rounder. She acts, she dances, she sings. And even if I say, I act, now, I dance, I sing, I think it's a perfect match. <laughs> She's 
she is one of my favorite follower, um, followers and now also one of my heroines and yes I was really happy and um, of course my experience with my on screen parents was I had a lot of fun first of all I'm really lucky to have such good looking on screen parents <laughs> Cheat codes which normal people don't know. There's a good 9 and 11 minute one hour? Yeah, yeah, it's a very long one hour. Huh? This is almost a 11 minute one shot which me and uh, Sam have done in, in the climax, you know, which is relentless action. And I was like, how are we going to achieve this? How are we going to do this? And they're like, me, this camera angle has to be like that. And they would keep retaking it because of a camera angle or because of a certain tilt that they wanted. And I, it, it's it's just amazing because I've done action otherwise also now but I've not seen this process I've never seen science of light so much to action so we also had when he shot the whole uh, scene and we realized he was an action hero waiting to burst out so the style and the whole action we didn't have to do much uh, in terms of you know getting a stunt to replace them and Samantha, we discovered her prowess in the Family Man season 2 when we realized that she can do her own action. So together, we suddenly became an instant combo. And I, and I think Varun was telling the action director some MLA moves that he wanted to do. Exactly. I was going to say that I was by the end, I think it was the last sequence and I think it was the 10th minute in that action sequence that I was on the floor and was like, this needs to end now and Varun is telling the uh, this one, uh, the Yannick, uh, the choreographer I think in that point zero two seconds I can do another flip kick I'm like, kill me already <laughs> He wanted, even in that little he was like, I can do a flip and I'll kick him and then I'll go The shop <laughs> No, but all I think he had we, we, we got, so I'm very proud of that. I'm very proud of the action sequence that uh, even me and uh, Sakeb have done with uh, the amount of dust you have put in that uh, sequence. So there are a lot of things I'll praise them for, but this is one thing I'll uh, call them out. They put, it was literally a spiral staircase like this with a free drop. Matlab, if me or Sakeb, our pair aise jata, there was literally a 30 or 40 meter drop down. And we, you have put a net, you have put a net. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, but scary, scary to fall. It was scary. You did a blast, you put a net or one two way, and I was like, God, why are we going so real? But that's what you realize when you shoot with Raj and DK. There's no studio setups coming. 
there's only going to be shooting in Thane, Bhayandar, Borevali, <laughs> very real locations. That's the real market. You've done that very well, huh? you put it very well. We were very real looking locations. We were really looking forward to the Russo's eye, Amazon Prime video. You know, the ballot team will be there. Yeah, you'll get a luxury, you'll get something like that. But, brother, you'll get something like that. You'll get something like that. You'll get something like that in real locations. <laughs> no, there, there was a location where he was fundamentally disagreeing with him. Gaurav and uh, Saira is like <laughs> very much <laughs> But Gaurav, everywhere you would shoot, there would be one guy from Amazon who would come who would say, I'm here for your security. So I would say, I'm here for your security. I'm here for your security. And he would say, No, sir, it looks secure. <laughs> but Gaurav, did you enjoy the. I had a great time. It was a, it was like a wake up call for me, and honestly, uh, hopefully, a lot of like you said, like a lot of people take notice of this, and you know, and uh, right now, I just feel that only the South Indians are taking notice of me huh? and giving me great uh, opportunities in action, which is true. Yes, we love you. Which is true. I think everything. I think I started working with Rajani and Sam, and next I'm working with Atli and Kirti. Uh, so it's. And Janvi is also kind of South Indian. <laughs> she is. So I think uh, hopefully that will lead the way for more other people in our industry. Hopefully, give me an. The reason I'm actually saying this is because during lockdown, I remember this actually started because during lockdown, I remember I met uh, Aditya Chopra. We were playing. He, he was playing badminton, and I got to play badminton with him and Manish, and they were making Tiger during that time. And I asked him, I said, Sir, why don't you, you know, make an action film with like younger talent? Why can't you ever take me and cast me? And he's like, No, I won't give you only acting roles. I don't want to give you action. I kept pursuing him, and then he was like, See, listen, I can't do that because I can't give you that budget right now. You're not at that place where I can give you such a big budget. And then I kept thinking, and then I just messaged him and asked him, Sir, what is the budget? And he gave me a figure that this is the budget you need to make something big in action. And I remember when this opportunity came, I even asked, I asked you all, I asked even Amazon. <laughs> they don't want me to say all this, but uh, <laughs> I said, hey, "What is the budget?" Because I'm getting this knowledge from Aditya Chopra that it's not cheap to make something look really good in action. And I'm really grateful uh, to Amazon and Raj and DK for giving us this platform, honestly, you know? because that is needed sometimes to make something look big. To make actors look larger than life, so I'm really grateful that you all, you know, put in that much strength and and the science to make this look like us. Well, now the global audience is waiting for you to announce. So welcome in this new avatar. And you know, you've spoken so much about geography, science, and physics, and now let's hop to the chemistry, which is the on-screen chemistry between Soham and Shivam. Okay, uh, you know, which we've shared incredible chemistry, like a bro code that both of you have now with Bunny. Now, how's the connection? Off screen as well as how did it translate on screen? Before that, just to introduce Shivankit. Shivankit is also a writer for TVF. He's written so many of their shows. He's also an actor. He's a. I I have seen a lot of stuff of Shivankit already on uh, YouTube. I've seen him. He was uh, his show is already with Amazon. Aspirants. Aspirants. And I was. I think Aspirants one was just and two was just amazing. He was amazing in it. Thank you. Thank you so much. So what everyone knows, I mean, from so much stuff he's done, but Kabir Singh was unbelievable in that. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Come to your bro. He told us nice things, so we say nice things about yeah, you. Yeah, that's, that's that's the plan. Okay. I think he's become a father now. I don't think the off-screen stuff. The entire media that showed up over here. I know it's been a crazy couple of days for all of us. Thank you for showing up and support. Please request Gaurav Gandhi. Please join us on the back of the stage. Please request.